everyone, it's Jen. Thanks so much for tuning into my channel. It is always great to see you, even though you know I can't see you, but I sorta can. Nope, I can't. If you're not subscribed yet to my channel, you can click below and click subscribe and you'll be notified every time I post a new video. So speaking of videos, I'm gonna do a Sephora haul. I feel like haul means that you bought a lot of things. Now, don't get me wrong. I've bought a lot of things at Sephora in the last week. I've actually been to three, four? I've been to four, oops. I've been to four different Sephoras and it's been a week. Yeah, I know it's a problem. And and I didn't buy, did I buy something every time? Maybe it went to three. Either way, there was one time where I didn't buy anything. But my friend, Barbara, got me something, so that might count. All right, so I was in the market for new foundation, and I actually went to Sephora, one of them, and got a BB cream. Turns out the color was wrong, and I decided that I actually wanted a foundation, not a BB cream, because I wanted it to last longer. So this amazing makeup artist at Sephora introduced me to Sephora's foundation brand. Let's just talk about this for a second because I don't know about you, but I rarely consider Sephora brand products. Not that I think that they're bad, I just think that the technology and other products is better, so I go for the other ones. However, I was proven wrong yesterday. Sephora's technology with their brand is really increasing. So I got their foundation. All right, so here it is. It is their 10 hour wear perfection foundation. It's oil free and it is, it's a second skin technology. I don't know if you can tell, but like I have it on today for the first time and I'm sold. I think this looks amazing. It feels very light, it's buildable, and it is only 20 bucks. So I feel like you can't go wrong. I think it's a lot of foundation for the price and the quality and I think I'm now converted to Sephora foundation. So I was in New York last week with two of my best friends and this is partially why we went into so many Sephoras. But one of the times we went in and it was just so insane. I, I couldn't even move and I just like didn't want to deal. However, my friend Barbara was telling me about this amazing dry shampoo. And I know I've talked about the Living Proof shampoo. I dry shampoo. I still love that. Do not get me wrong, but Barbara introduced me to chlorine. Now, chlorine has a lot of different dry shampoos and I've tried a lot of them. However, this one is different. This is the, wow, barely any of this is in English, dry shampoo with nettle. I'm not sure what nettle is, but it's the one with the green top. Now, I told you I've been to four Sephora's. None of them had the full size version. All of them had the travel size version. So Barbara, thank you for getting this for me. I'm absolutely obsessed and I have ordered the full size online. So since I'm talking about hair, you may have noticed I got my hair cut a little bit and I am finally getting used to it and liking it. But what I've noticed with my thin hair is that I always need texture and I use obviously dry shampoos and texturizers and there's so much out there and my medicine cabinet is actually overflowing because I have so many. But I have found a new favorite. I use it with other things, but it is Whey. I don't know if you've tried Whey products yet, but they smell amazing. And this is the texturizing hairspray. So I really like using this. Actually, my hair's looking a little flat. Let's see if you can tell texture. Oops. You know how certain smells remind you of things? Like this reminds me of like my aunt's house when I was younger. It smells good, it's like perfume. So if you're allergic to scents, probably isn't the brand for you. All right, let's see. So it gave my hair a little bit more texture. It gives it uh, like that grippy texture. So when I curl my hair, it's easier. It helps it stay longer. So uh, loving this. So I have two more things to show you. One of them is Hourglass, and it's the Hourglass Blush. It is actually um, ambient lighting blush in dim fusion. Now my friend Madeline in Alabama, her and I Snapchat each other almost every time we go into Sephora. She'll send me a text and ask me what's new, what should she get, or what am I loving lately, and I realize I haven't done Sephora haul lately, so Madeline, this is also for you. I discovered this yesterday. So this is Hourglass's blush, and it's really, really pretty. I love this, I used it today. It's very subtle, but it just, it doesn't shimmer, but you glow. So that combined with my new foundation, Hourglass products are some of my favorites. I have quite a few of them. I just love how they look on your skin. Last, but definitely not least, so I've had my eye on the Cabernacoa product line. However, none of the Sephora's that I've been into have had the line, except for the one in Water Tower, which I went to yesterday. Water Tower's in Chicago, by the way. And I think I'm saying his name right. 
I asked the girls before like a million times. So Kevin Aqua makes a lot of amazing things, but this is his bronzer and it is Tropical Nights Cool Breeze. I think it comes in two colors and wait till you see it. First of all, the packaging, it comes in like the velour little packet, but watch. Oh. Okay. So I don't know if you can tell, I think you can. It's like a gradient so it goes from lighter to darker which means you can adjust it depending on the look that you're going for as opposed to all the other bronzers that are just like one color and then you find yourself collecting them like me i am with so many bronzers but this is really really nice because i get all these colors and again i used it today along with the ambient light blush and my new foundation and i'm really loving this look so it's like getting four bronzers in one right because you get like all those colors whatever i tell myself so that's it for my sephora haul i know there's a million other things i purchased there in the last uh however many months since i last did a sephora haul video however these are my favorites and I got them in the last week. So thank you so much for watching. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and I will see you next time. Have an awesome day. Bye.